So I want to talk about topical relevancy and its importance in SEO. Now many a times that you will find yourself trying to optimize for certain articles, optimize certain articles on your blog and you might not really rank well because there are many people who are very specialized in that area or that topic. Now let me take an example. Now suppose you have a general real estate site and you want to rank for the term how to negotiate a lease agreement. Now I've not checked the search results for this term at the, at the time of this recording but I, I can hypothesize a guess that if Google has to determine the relevancy of those results yes it would look for the most relevant articles but it would also give slight preference to those sites which have some kind of topical relevance to lease agreements, rentals in general. So if you are writing a post on a very generic real estate blog on how to negotiate a lease agreement you might build links, you might get some authority which can help you rank to a certain extent but what definitely can help is if you had a few more articles on that topic or so I would assume because I've, I've seen that to work in other articles that we have developed for our own blogs. So if you have more related content around a particular topic it's sort of like telling the search engines that I am not only I'm not doing this just for this one article there are I have a lot more related articles related to this topic. So let's take, let's take this example of how to negotiate a lease agreement. Now you develop an article on that. What if you when you're coming up with content ideas why not write more on topics related to that give like a sample lease agreement give sample content and uh, email outlines of how you could email your prospective landlords or communication styles on uh, how to word a lease agreement. There are many uh, ways you could go about writing subtopics related to that main central topic that you have. So what you want to do is essentially tell the search engines that I am not just a single article piece on this topic. I do have a lot of content related to the topic and that gives you a slightly more uh, higher score when it comes to thematic or topical relevance. So if, if we take that as a factor, I think that's a factor you can play with and how you can play with that is developing more content related to the keyword that you're targeting. So many people when they write content, they'll just pick one keyword, target keyword, write one article, move on to the next topic. I think you can build authority by writing subsets on the same topic, targeting many long tail variations of the same topic and that can only help boost your authority within that domain. So a smarter way to go when going about content development is when you've picked a content piece, try to write everything related around that, master that topic, become a leader in that space and that should go a long way in helping you rank further. So yeah, keep that in mind when doing content development and when um, thinking about what to write next.